Built in 1961 to stop East Germans fleeing west, it's now a tourist attraction. It's incredible. Not a sight of great happiness. No, but, but they've kept it and turned it into something positive, I suppose. They've salvaged something good. Yeah. The East Side Gallery, or Art Mile, features 101 paintings commissioned after the fall of the wall in 1989. No one's chosen to commemorate Hasselhoff's contribution in any way. From the nearly 200 museums to choose from, we've selected the twice-nominated European Museum of the Year, the DDR, in which a bod can interactively experience life as it used to be in what was the first socialist state on German soil. Oh. I see why this museum's so busy now. Four out of five East Germans regularly went swimming unattired. That's a great stat. I'm not sure about the tennis nude. That feels like it's just yeah, taking it to another extreme. That a lot of stuff is ungoverned. <laughs> With much of life under surveillance, the home became a pallet on which the self was writ. It looks like Coronation Street. I don't watch that for political reasons. <laughs> now, this I like. Easy access to the toilet. There's normally doors, though, right? Not during this era. I'd like to get back to this era. I mean, this is ideal. <laughs> <laughs> Homes under the hammer. Deal Are you or no sure deal. Didn't have doors? Deal or no deal. <laughs> deal or no deal. Deal. <laughs> and you're back. Sexual education? Nothing I don't know. There's a lot I don't know. Loads. Why? <gasps> oh, Why? I'm just face to face with the vagina. Why is it up in that cupboard? Is that standard issue? That's where you keep the vaginas, Richard. <laughs> okay, the kitchen's nice. It's good. There's um, access through, there's it flow feels through. Like we're a couple and you're the laziest husband looking at a house. <laughs> yeah. OK, there's a company in here called Women's Day. At work, the comrade director presented various hardworking women with medals and cash bonuses. Everybody present thanked the party and state for achieving gender equality. The afternoon was one long round of coffee and cake. Not only did the men serve the women, they even did the washing up. I'm pleased that didn't catch on. The state also sanctioned a pretty racy-looking dance called the Lipsy. They thought rock and roll was too capitalist. Well, they'd probably heard Billy Joel by this stage. Do you dance at all? No, I don't. I don't know what it's for. For yourself? Like, dance like no-one's watching? Dancing for yourself. <laughs> Listen to that statement back in your own head. <laughs> I dance think we should learn yourself. Lipsy. I'm not learning Lipsy. Lipsy's the devil's oh, you've music. Got very formal. You've no. pulled your. <laughs> okay. I live my life by the same rules as Captain Mannering. Right. Dignity. <laughs> Full dignity and never remove your trousers. 